In physics, naturalness is the property that the dimensionless ratios between free parameters or physical constants appearing in a physical theory should take values of order 1, and that free parameters are not fine-tuned. That is, a natural theory would have parameter ratios with values like 2.34 rather than 234,000 or 0.000234. The requirement that satisfactory theories should be natural in this sense is a current of thought initiated around the 1960s in particle physics. It is an aesthetic criterion, not a physical one, that arises from the seeming non-naturalness of the standard model and the broader topics of the hierarchy problem, fine-tuning, and the anthropic principle. However it does tend to suggest a possible area of weakness or future development for current theories such as the standard model, where some parameters vary by many orders of magnitude, and which require extensive fine-tuning of their current values of the models concerned. The concern is that it is not yet clear whether these seemingly exact values we currently recognize, have arisen by chance based upon the anthropic principle or similar or whether they arise from a more advanced theory not yet developed, in which these turn out to be expected and well explained, because of other factors not yet part of particle physics models. The concept of naturalness is not always compatible with Occam's razor, since many instances of natural theories have more parameters than fine-tuned theories such as the standard model. Naturalness in physics is closely related to the issue of fine-tuning, and over the past decade many scientists argued that the principle of naturalness is a specific application of Bayesian statistics. Topic. Overview A simple example Suppose a physics model requires four parameters which allow it to produce a very high-quality working model, calculations, and predictions of some aspect of our physical universe. Suppose we find through experiments that the parameters have values 1.2 1.31 0 0.9 and 404 octillion 331 septillion 557 sextillion 902 quintillion 116 quadrillion 24 trillion 553 billion 602 million 703,216.58 roughly 4 by 1029, we might wonder how such figures arise. But in particular we might be especially curious about a theory where three values are close to one, and the fourth is so different, in other words, the huge disproportion we seem to find between the first three parameters and the fourth. We might also wonder, if one force is so much larger than the others that it needs a factor of 4 by 1029 to allow it to be related to them in terms of effects, how did our universe come to be so exactly balanced when its forces emerged? In current particle physics the differences between some parameters are much larger than this, so the question is even more noteworthy. One answer given by some physicists is the anthropic principle. If the universe came to exist by chance, and perhaps vast numbers of other universes exist or have existed, then life capable of physics experiments only arose in universes that by chance had very balanced forces. All the universes where the forces were not balanced, didn't develop life capable of the question. So if a life form like human beings asks such a question, it must have arisen in a universe having balanced forces, however rare that might be. So when we look, that is what we would expect to find, and what we do find. A second answer is that perhaps there is a deeper understanding of physics, which, if we discovered and understood it, would make clear these aren't really fundamental parameters and there is a good reason why they have the exact values we have found, because they all derive from other more fundamental parameters that are not so unbalanced. <laughs> 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 
Topic: Introduction. In particle physics, the assumption of naturalness means that, unless a more detailed explanation exists, all conceivable terms in the effective action that preserve the required symmetries should appear in this effective action with natural coefficients. In an effective field theory, lambda is the cutoff scale, an energy or length scale at which the theory breaks down. Due to dimensional analysis, natural coefficients have the form h equals c lambda 4 minus d display style h equals c lambda caret 4d where d is the dimension of the field operator and c is a dimensionless number which should be random and smaller than 1 at the scale where the effective theory breaks down Further renormalization group running can reduce the value of C at an energy scale E, but by a small factor proportional to ln E, lambda. Some parameters in the effective action of the standard model seem to have far smaller coefficients than required by consistency with the assumption of naturalness, leading to some of the fundamental open questions in physics. In particular, the naturalness of the QCD theta parameter leads to the strong CP problem because it is very small experimentally consistent with zero rather than of order of magnitude unity. The naturalness of the Higgs mass leads to the hierarchy problem because it is 17 orders of magnitude smaller than the Planck mass that characterizes gravity. Equivalently, the Fermi constant characterizing the strength of the weak force is very, very large compared to the gravitational constant characterizing the strength of gravity. The naturalness of the cosmological constant leads to the cosmological constant problem because it is at least 40 and perhaps as much as 100 or more orders of magnitude smaller than natively expected. In addition, the coupling of the electron to the Higgs, the mass of the electron, is abnormally small, and to a lesser extent, the masses of the light quarks. In models with large extra dimensions, the assumption of naturalness is violated for operators which multiply field operators that create objects which are localized at different positions in the extra dimensions. Topic: <laughs> Naturalness and the gauge hierarchy problem. A more practical definition of naturalness is that for any observable O display style O which consists of n independent contributions O equals a 1 plus plus a n Display style O equals a underscore one plus C D O T S plus A underscore N. Then all independent contributions to O display style O should be comparable to or less than O display style O. Otherwise, if one contribution, say a one O display style a underscore one g g o. Then some other independent contribution would have to be fine tuned to a large opposite sign value, such as to maintain O display style O at its measured value. Such fine tuning is regarded as unnatural and indicative of some missing ingredient in the theory. For instance, in the standard model with Higgs potential given by V equals minus mu 2 phi phi plus lambda phi phi 2 
Display style v equals mu caret two phi caret dagger phi plus lambda phi caret dagger phi caret two. The physical Higgs boson mass is calculated to be m h two equals two mu two plus delta m h 2 display style m underscore h caret 2 equals 2 mu caret 2 plus delta m underscore h caret 2 where the quadratically divergent radiative correction is given by delta m h 2 3 4 pi 2 minus lambda t 2 plus g 2 4 plus g 2 8 cos 2 theta w plus Lambda Lambda two Display style delta M underscore H carrot two simic FRAC three four pi carrot two BIGL Lambda underscore T carrot two plus FRAC G carrot two four plus FRAC G carrot two eight cos carrot two theta underscore W plus Lambda big R Lambda carrot two where lambda t display style lambda underscore t is the top quark Yakawa coupling g display style g is the su 2 gauge coupling and lambda display style lambda is the energy cutoff to the divergent loop integrals as delta m h two display style delta m underscore h caret two increases depending on the chosen cutoff lambda display style lambda, then mu two display style mu caret two can be freely dialed so as to maintain m h display style m underscore h at its measured value, now known to be m h one hundred twenty five display style m underscore h simic one hundred twenty five gev by insisting on naturalness, then delta m h two meters h two display style delta m underscore h caret two. Solving for lambda display style lambda, one finds lambda one display style lambda tev. This then implies that the standard model as a natural effective field theory is only valid up to the one tev energy scale. Sometimes it is complained that this argument depends on the regularization scheme introducing the cutoff lambda display style lambda and perhaps the problem disappears under dimensional regularization. In this case, if new particles which couple to the Higgs are introduced, one once again regains the quadratic divergence now in terms of the new particle squared masses. For instance, if one includes C saw neutrinos into the standard model, then delta m h display style delta m underscore h would blow up to near the C saw scale, typically expected in the 10 13 display style 10 caret 13 GeV range. Topic. Naturalness, supersymmetry and the little hierarchy By supersymmetrizing the standard model, one arrives at a solution to the gauge hierarchy, or big hierarchy, problem in that supersymmetry guarantees cancellation of quadratic divergences to all orders in perturbation theory. The simplest supersymmetrization of the SM leads to the 
Minimal Supersymmetric Standard Model or MSSM. In the MSSM, each SM particle has a partner particle known as a super partner or sparticle. For instance, the left and right electron helicity components have scalar partner selectrons E tilde L display style tilde E underscore L and E tilde R display style tilde E underscore R respectively whilst the eight colored gluons have eight colored spin minus one half gluino superpartners. The MSSM Higgs sector must necessarily be expanded to include two rather than one doublets leading to five physical Higgs particles H H A display style H H A and H plus or minus display style H caret PM whilst three of the eight Higgs component fields are absorbed by the W plus or minus display style W caret PM and Z display style Z bosons to make them massive the MSSM is actually supported by three different sets of measurements which test for the presence of virtual superpartners. 1. The celebrated weak scale measurements of the three gauge coupling strengths are just what is needed for gauge coupling unification at a scale q 2 times 10 16 display style q simic 2 times 10 caret 16 gev 2 the value of m t 173 display style m underscore t simic 173 gev falls squarely in the range needed to trigger a radiatively driven breakdown in electroweak symmetry and 3. The measured value of M H 125 display style M underscore H simic 125 GEV falls within the narrow window of allowed values for the MSSM. Nonetheless, verification of weak scale SUSY WSS, SUSY with superpartner masses at or around the weak scale as characterized by M W Z H 100 display style M W Z H sim 100 GEV requires the direct observation of at least some of the superpartners at sufficiently energetic colliding beam experiments. As recent as 2017, the CERN Large Hadron Collider, A P P style P P Collider operating at center of mass energy 13 TeV has not found any evidence for superpartners. This has led to mass limits on the Gluino M G tilde greater than two display style M underscore tilde G greater than two TeV and on the lighter top squark M T tilde one greater than 1 display style m underscore tilde t underscore 1 greater than 1 tev within the context of certain simplified models which are assumed to make the experimental analysis more tractable 
Along with these limits, the rather large measured value of m h 125 display style m underscore h semic 125 GeV seems to require TeV scale highly mixed top squarks. These combined measurements have raised concern now about an emerging little hierarchy problem characterized by M W Z H M S P A R T I C L E display style M underscore W Z H L L M underscore Spartacle under the little hierarchy one might expect the now log divergent light Higgs mass to blow up to the Spartacle mass scale unless one fine tunes the little hierarchy problem has led to concern that WSS is perhaps not realized in nature or at least not in the manner typically expected by theorists in years past. Topic status of naturalness and the little hierarchy in the MSSM, the light Higgs mass is calculated to be mh2 equals mu2 plus mh u2 plus mixing plus loops display style m underscore h caret 2 equals mu caret 2 plus m underscore h underscore u caret 2 plus erm mixing plus erm loops where the mixing and loop contributions are MH2 display style but where in most models the soft Suzy breaking up Higgs mass MH U2 display style M underscore H underscore U carrot 2 is driven to large TeV scale negative values in order to break electroweak symmetry. Then, to maintain the measured value of mh equals 125 display style m underscore h equals 125 GeV, one must tune the superpotential mass term mu2 display style mu caret 2 to some large positive value. Alternatively, for natural Susie, one may expect that m h u Two display style m underscore h underscore u caret two runs to small negative values, in which case both mu display style mu and m h u display style m underscore h underscore u are of order 100 to 200 GeV. This already leads to a prediction, since mu display style mu is supersymmetric and feeds mass to both SM particles W, Z, H, and superpartners Higgsinos. Then it is expected from the natural MSSM that light Higgsinos exist nearby to the 100 to 200 GeV scale. This simple realization has profound implications for WSS collider and dark matter searches. Naturalness in the MSSM has historically been expressed in terms of the Z display style Z boson mass, and indeed this approach leads to more stringent upper bounds on sparticle masses. By minimizing the Coleman-Weinberg scalar potential of the MSSM, then one may relate the measured value of M Z equals 91.2 2 GeV to the Susie Lagrangian parameters M Z 2 2 equals M H D 
2 plus sigma d d i minus tan 2 beta m h u 2 plus sigma u u j tan 2 beta minus 1 minus mu 2 minus m h u 2 minus sigma u u i minus mu 2 Display style FRAC M underscore Z carrot two two equals FRAC M underscore H underscore D carrot two plus Sigma underscore D carrot D I tan carrot two beta M underscore H underscore U carrot two plus Sigma underscore U carrot U J tan carrot two beta minus one mu carrot two simic M underscore H underscore U Carrot two sigma underscore u carrot u i mu carrot two here tan beta five minus fifty display style tan beta sim five to fifty is the ratio of Higgs field vacuum expectation values v u V D display style V underscore U V underscore D and M H D two display style M underscore H underscore D carrot two is the down Higgs soft breaking mass term the sigma D D I display style sigma underscore D carrot D I and sigma U U J display style sigma underscore U carrot U J contain a variety of loop corrections labeled by indices i and j, the most important of which typically comes from the top squarks. In the renowned review work of P. Nils, titled, Supersymmetry, Supergravity and Particle Physics, published on Phys. Rept. 110-1984-1-162, one finds the sentence. Experiments within the next five to ten years will enable us to decide whether supersymmetry as a solution of the naturalness problem of the weak interaction scale is a myth or a reality. See also Fine tuning, Hierarchy problem Large extra dimensions Split supersymmetry